Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Welcome to IT for Solution. Now we have completed all of these menu items, and now I'm I'm going to show you that how can you create a simplest website using WordPress theme without using Elementor or without using any other advanced plugins or things. Uh, we can use we will use Elementor in our further videos in next videos, and we will inshallah develop a complete website using Elementor. So now in this video we have to create a website by using simple themes. So this is our website. This is our basic website, and this is our by default theme. Now I'm going to change my theme. So click on Appearance Themes, and here you click on Add New. <coughs> And now we have here installed theme, and here you can see we have featured themes, popular themes. And we have latest themes, favorites, and many more. Now I'm gonna search here. You can search here theme by its name. I have selected iconic one. So this is a theme which I am going to show you that how can you create a website using this theme. So click on install. Now this theme is installing in our WordPress. As this theme is installed, now click on activate button. And here you can see a message like thank you for choosing iconic one and etc. So now click on our website and click on reload this page. Now you guys see the settings of this website is now changed according to this theme. This is our by default settings of that theme. Now we have going to change some other things like we have here home. It is like pretty good. You can also write text here. If you want to change any anything in home page, so you can come here, click on pages, <coughs> home page, and click on edit. This is our front page, and here you can also change image. You have many options. You can select image in circle mask, in transform to this, and you can also add gallery of images here. So you can select image from media. I have selected these three images. For adding to gallery, you can write here caption first image about coding, whatever you want to write. If you make them empty, then it will also upload it. Here is our gallery align left, align center, align right. It depends on you that which type of you want to get this. Okay, now. I'm gonna click on update this page and if you refresh this page now you guys see this is our gallery and this is our text that we can write here this is a simple example now let's back to this and click on remove image and remove image remove image And here transform to image. Here you can select a simple image which is this C sharp and C plus plus image. Here you can click on update button. Here is the simple image. 
now if you want to add another pages to your menu i have already told you that you how can you add pages to your menu let me show you that how can we add new pages in our menu here i'm gonna add page my team and here i'm gonna type a text for this first of all i have to select classic editor then go for lorem ipsum from this i can copy simple text copy and I'm going to paste this text in there and i can upload some images here like gallery for example uh, because now i have no pictures of my friends in my laptop for example these are images of my friend and i have to upload these pictures into my website page which is my team or my friend so insert it this gallery click on publish and publish so if we guys can refresh you guys see not nothing can be changed in this menu so we have to click on appearance and menus and we have click on this my team add to menu now this my team page is added to our menu we can have to click on this save menu and when we refresh this page it will show us my team here is my team members here here is my team member and image of my team members for example if these have your image and you can also you guys see caption of image about coding first image and it is and guys if you if you want that when you whenever you created a page it will automatically show here it will automatically add it to into your menu then you for this you have to click on menus and click on automatically add new top level pages to this menu and this was our primary menu then we have to click on save menu if we add a new page now click on add new if we click uh, we have to type title of our page which is about us and here we have some text and now press control so for the shift alt and j2 now after this if you want to <coughs> justify this text you should have to click on classic editor so we click control z so click on this and click classic editor and here you can paste your text oh. then you can also make its heading lists group and verse you want what whatever you want to like so let's do it in a classic editor click on classic editor and here you can paste text and can press shift alt and J to justify this text. You can justify your text in classic editor. Now, if you want to add image here in our text, we can click on. Let me show you once again. We can click on this add media, or we can plus shift. We can press keys shift plus alt plus M. So click on this and click insert into page. Now this image is inserted to our page. Now you have options to align this image wherever you want to align this image here from center align left I think this looks good and click on publish 
if you guys now refresh this page and you can see about us page it it will it automatically inserted into our menu bar we we cannot have to go to menus and from there we we don't need to add it this page from that side so our pages are created now uh, you guys see if you want a drop down menu like in my team i want to show my team members like i have uh, uh, rofia seen ali ashraf and uh, one more member or three more three members or two members let me show you once again so come here in appearance menus here you can deselect this automatically at top new level pages to this menu because now i'm going to show you that how can we manage our drop down menus in wordpress uh, by using uh, when i when by using or creating another page so if this box is checked then <coughs> this page will automatically show in our menu bar so uncheck this option and click on save menu come to pages and click on add new page for example i have this page in roof roof here seen and here i am going to write about roof here seen that he was he is a great programmer and lots of experience have made a, uh, many of the softwares and now for this time i can all putting here a dummy text so because this is a simplest website so now if you want to justify this text you can press shift alt and j and here you can also add image i want to add image here about rofia scene uh, i don't have image of, of rofia scene at this time so i'm going to add this page this image into my page so here i have options to justify this image right so this is looking good click on publish publish and i have to create a new page and here my i have another member which is usman ali so at this time i'm going to put it gallery here i have three pictures create a new gallery i have removing this caption now insert gallery into this image and i want to write some text here so i'm going to publish this page this page is also published and now you guys see if i can refresh this page uh, this uh, my website page then the those pages are cannot shown in my menu bar so i'm going to add another page which is adil rauf <coughs> and i'm going to type here some text and publish in this page after publishing now i'm going to show you that how can we create a drop down menu in wordpress so click on appearance menus and i'm going to insert i i have to insert these pages in my team so first of all i have to pick rofia seen usman ali and adil rauf click add to menu now these are inserted in this menu if i will save them in this condition let me show you what happens you guys see these are in our menu bar which i was not wanted to show them here so i want to show them in my team members so click on menu once again and pick a rofia scene and down to my team and slightly drag it to right side here as you guys you see it is now sub item of my team and my team here is adil rof and usmani now i'm going to save this menu here guys if uh, you can come here here you can see rofia seen adil rof and usman ali 
if you click on Rofia Chin, you will see his work and about Rofia Chin, what he has done and what he has like to do in Adil Rauf. This is Adil's profile and this is Usman Ali's profile. It's his pictures about his uh, pictures or about his projects pictures, whatever you want to do. This is this is our menu bar and contact us. You guys know about this menu. This is uh, this menu is created by using plugin contact form 7 and I don't have we don't need now to create a <coughs> menu in this theme now uh, I have completed these tasks if I can add a new theme then these uh, this work is automatically shifted into that theme according to its themes settings so now I have to show you about these widgets so click on appearance and widgets I I will uh, I don't want calendar in my widget so click on calendar and drag it to left side recent comments matter and I want archives in my widgets now if we can refresh our website this is archives about comments and meta so if you want an image or want to add an image in your widget so you have to add a plugin click on plugin and click on add new <coughs> so click on add widget image widget image you have different plugins with different names you can search them by name here you have some widgets about image so this time I'm going to use this image widget click on install now this is this widget is now installing Now this widget is installed and now click on activate button. Now we click on widgets. Here you can see this is image widget. So drag this widget top of this side and click on select an image uh, I want this image like this here you can type alternate text or a caption or description of this image this is uh, it depends on you that you want to write or not so click on insert into widget and now if you want to add link on this image you can also if uh, somebody can click on this link and uh, this image and it will go to another link I am going to show you next <coughs> how to do it now you have to save this image and we can click refresh this you guys see this is our image widget 
here you can change its name which is creative wallpapers so click on this uh, so you have to rename this image as my channel my youtube channel or my channel so you rename this and click on save button here yeah. now i don't have uh, any other picture about my channel so i'm going to paste it link of my channel i'm going to click on this copy this link uh, any link you want to add to your image so click on widget and here paste this link link title my youtube channel now save this link and refresh this page you guys see now it's changed my youtube channel if i can click on this widget i am transferred to my youtube channel so these these are the simplest ways to create a simplest website using wordpress without using elementor or any advanced other plugins <coughs> now guys uh, you can see that this is the simplest simplest method of creating a simplest website in wordpress without any plugin so uh, let me show you one more thing if you want that you can add a gallery here uh, here you you have uh, you wanted a menu uh, like my gallery uh, for this first of all we have to create a page <coughs> named as my gallery as i have created already now i am going to add this page in my menu bar so i have to click on menus and here click on my gallery and now i am going to click to add to menu let me check where it appears yes here and now click on save menu if i can come here and refresh this page now my gallery is appear in our menu bar so here is uh, nothing in this page so i want to add a menu uh, add a gallery in this page so let me show you that how can we add a gallery in this page for this i i have to add a plugin here so click on plugins <coughs> and click on add new plugin from here we can add a plugin and for adding a plugin we have to type here gallery uh here we have options of some other plugins like featured popular recommended and favorites now we are going to install this plugin uh, you have many more plugin you can also install any plugin which you want now click on install now and uh, the sometime plugins will take time to uh, make the installation and i think this will also take some time so guys these are some simplest methods of creating a website using wordpress without any further more plugins or uh, advanced techniques so in my next videos i'm going to show you that how can we create websites header footers how can we make our websites beautiful using elementor now guys as you can see this plug is installed now click on activate plugin after this this plugin has activated and then i'm go i'll show you that how can we create a, a gallery so we allow and continue now guys as uh, our next gen gallery plugin is installed now i'm going to show you that how can we add a gallery in my gallery page so click on <coughs> pages now here we have to edit my page my gallery click on edit button and here click on this plus icon and select next gen gallery so click on button add next gen gallery here you have options to add gallery style uh, which style you like you you can select like i i like this style so i'm going to select this so here you you can upload image from here you have create a new gallery here you 
have to type a title my my gallery so add files in desktop i have a folder of images uh, let me check here where is my folder here i have folder named as pics so from here i have now these pics so i'm going to select these pictures now you have to click on start upload button after this this these images starting started uploading to this gallery upload complete great job my gallery one so click on insert into page select a gallery which is my gallery and now insert on gallery so click on update if we come here and refresh this page now you guys see this is our gallery that i have created recently now if you can click this image this image will show you as this have you guys seen that how simple this website is and how can we create this website using simple tricks here you can like for give set uh, by this selecting these emo emojis you can give reactions to this post so this is the basic website i hope guys you like this video in next video i am going to show you uh, by using elementor how can we create professional websites so stay tuned hope guys i hope you guys like this video kindly subscribe to my channel and share this video to your friends this is the simplest way of creating a very simple website in wordpress uh, in next video i am going to show you that how can you use multiple sites in wordpress and how can we use word uh, elementor in wordpress to create professional websites so stay tuned for further more next videos till then allah hafiz assalamu alaikum